This is something to note, too. As this virus continues to spread, scams are also on the rise. Yeah, criminals always take advantage in situations like this. They're trying to con you and even get personal information as they play on your fears. Arvelina Jones is breaking down what you need to watch out for tonight. Yeah, with so much unknown about the coronavirus, buyers are trying to find any type of solution to avoid getting sick. But it's important while doing that that you protect yourself from becoming a victim. Now, we wanted to know the top scams related to COVID-19 and how to avoid being duped. We sat down with the Northwest and Pacific Better Business Bureau. They tell us there are three major scams you should keep an eye on. One targets people who are looking to buy the N95 mask from unreliable web sites who take your money and never send you the product. The FDA has also flagged seven companies who are selling products claiming to prevent or cure the coronavirus. Those are all false claims. In this context, we are talking about a brand new global pandemic. Nobody knows how to act. Therefore, scams can change. Scammers can shift their tactics. And we're all kind of just playing our best defense, if you will, uh, to try and not get scammed. Another popular scam comes from imposters calling, pretending to be from the medical field, who could ask for your personal health information. Kane tells me if you see claims advertised relating to the coronavirus, you should take precautions and verify those claims before purchasing anything or giving away your personal information. Now, we, of course, talked to the BBB and contacted several different local law enforcement agencies around. They all tell us that here locally so far, they have not had any fraud cases reported to them. Reporting live in downtown Portland, Valina Jones, Queen 6 News. Valina, thank you. And